Welcome back to some more Pokemon Pocket. Uh, I've had a hard time trying to get this to work today. I don't know what was going on, but I could not get my phone to cast to the computer. But we're here. We got two packs we should be able to open. I hope at least one. Um, got one booster pack. We're all done with our water deck. Let's actually look up where we can get Misty from. So she's in the Pikachu deck. Uh, you got a. 2.5% chance and a 1.7% chance to get her. So I guess we're gonna be open Pikachu decks, which is fine by me. Let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. Actually, let's see. We have 124, so we're just gonna open 10. Um, yeah, open. That's fine. I guess this is just like our free one because it didn't really give me an option. Anything new? Growlithe? Growlithe is new. Growlithe is new. But no, not too much. Which, it's good. Because we want to complete the Kanto decks to get Mew, but we're still a long ways away from that. We have a lot of cards, but uh, completing the Kanto decks is going to be a bit of a behemoth. Okay. Open to packs. Oh, it's only going to cost us 112. Nice. Okay, let's go. Let's see if we get a really good pack with the stars. Still haven't gotten one yet. That's how it goes. Alright, let's see. Zepstrika, Psyduck, anything new? Gyarados, that was new. Click through it really fast though. A new Pikachu, a new Sea King, Doug Trio's new, Petalil, Zapdos, that's good. Raging Thunder. 100 also does 30 damage to one of your bench Pokemon. I don't think we like that. We don't like that at all. Radicate, the Wool, Petalo, the Trio, Frosmoth, Seal, Metapod, Love, Metapod, Love, Metapod Line, Lieutenant Surge. That's good. Move all electric energy from your bench Pokemon to your Raichu Electrode Electabuzz. Uh oh, I don't know if we like that. Uh, but that could be good on like a Magneton that can get energy every round so could be the move Nidorino nice Clopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopopop
We can try to get another Sabrina, but I don't really want that. We have been trying to go for Giovanni, because he gives you an extra 10 on your attacks. But I don't know if we want to go for that deck or not. So this one has three cards we don't have. I thought we had this Bishop though. I could have sworn we got that. Let's see. And this one only has two cards. Alright, let's try to go for Giovanni. If we get it, we get it. If we don't, we don't. I'm not great at super ah, these wonder picks. I don't think I think there's only been one time I've gotten the card that I really wanted. Yeah. Nice. Not great, but, you know, at least we got something new, so. Thank you. Let's see, can we build a new deck or edit any of our decks with what we just got? Flip a coin, if, if heads during your opponent's next turn prevent all damage from and effects of attacks done to this Pokemon. Digs? Not bad. How many of those guys do we have? Maybe we can do a, a fighting deck. Let's see. I think get rid of that. And Kabuto for Diglett and Dark Trio. There's just not like a lot of synergy here. Okay. So this will just be like a decent example of like an early fighting deck that you can make, especially if you're doing free to play. So you're gonna have a few basic fighting types. Sancho and Diglett are gonna be good because they have cheap moves, uh, and when they evolve, they also have similarly cheap moves, but hit pretty hard. Like Sand Slash does 70, and you have 100 health. The Chu's move is also pretty cheap. It only costs one energy, but it only does 40 damage. But you do have the opportunity to miss damage or any effects of other cards. Uh, kind of similar to Frostmoth in that case, where it's like you can put things to sleep and hopefully avoid damage for a turn. This is kind of like a, a stall, you know, hope and pray kind of a move. Mankey's also decent. Uh, I mean, if you have any damage on you, you go from a 40 move to 100 only for two energy. So that's a pretty good early on fighting move. I did manage to get the Machamp line in here, Machop, Machook, and Machamp, and then Seismic Toss for, for three energy and 100 damage. But he also has 150 HP, which is really good. So gonna be putting him on the back line, hopefully, and just kind of building up to him. Uh, and then you just have like your normal trainer cards. Uh, HP for sustain, Pokeballs to try to find basic Pokemon, and then research to pull out as many cards as quickly as you can. I do have Pokedex red card uh, in there and a hand scope mostly because I just don't have any more trainer cards since I'm doing free to play right now. And then I do have Sabrina, but she's pretty good at all times. I wish I had another one. Slaughter in there, kind of have control over your opponent's deck a little bit, make them waste energies. So that's the kind of fighting deck we're working with right now, and we'll see how we do. It's not great, but if you're doing free to play, it might be a decent option if you can find some of these guys. I would really like to find like a, Macho a Machamp EX or something like that, or get a, what's it called? Uh, not Kabuto, Kabutops. That'd be cool, because we almost have that line done, but I don't have him. So, we'll get there eventually. But it's hard, man, especially with some of these people who are just like already dumping so much money in. Like, I went up against a, a crazy Pikachu deck the, last night. It was just brutal. Ah, <laughs> uh, we're going for Starmie, are we? Starmie's so good. Um, I'm just gonna go Pokedex. Uh, so we don't have a lot coming up, but we do have Machamp. 
which is pretty decent. We're gonna red card him so he starts off with one less card. Hopefully he doesn't have star me, or hopefully he didn't have star me. Hopefully we didn't just give it to him, but you know, why not? Snom. I would love to have another card too that's not Hitmonchan. Yeah, just, you know, he's not bad, but just 30 damage isn't my favorite. But we should be able to take this out before he gets us as long as he doesn't evolve. So that could be good. We have a potion on us. So if we can get the free hit in before he evolves, that would be pretty solid. Because if he gets Star Me EX right now, it's it's over. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> before it even begins. 90 damage. Gah, man. So strong right out the gate. And we know we're not gonna get we're not gonna get any items. That's it. That's actually match. Yeah, we're just gonna concede. Cause I mean, he's gonna knock me out, and that'll be match right there. So we'll just <laughs> wrap that one up. <laughs> Chalk it up to a loss. <laughs> Free to play is tough. Free to play is is really tough. It'd be nice to be able to get all the cards up front, but like, man, just working with what they give you. Whoa, 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 whoa. <sighs> Maybe this one. Maybe this one, yeah. <laughs> Maybe this one we can try to stay in. The thing about this like game is it's so easy to just get swept. Especially if you're free to play. Alright, let's see. See if we can outlast. I'm going second. That's good. So we'll have energy first. Part of me doesn't really want to start with Mach Machamp, but we'll be going in on the, our third turn. Our, our second turn being able to do 50 damage, so... I don't think we have any better options. Because we'll be able to hit first. So we'll be able to do 20 and then 50 before he can even hit us once. Which is good, so we'll be able to get that knockout. So that'll be good. I'm not super sure. I need to close my window. It's a lot of glare. Okay. He does have his bench stacked. Sabrina. Okay, we're gonna take out this Bulbasaur because if he evolves, I'm assuming he's gonna, you know, evolve into EX. Nice, got Minky. I really like I, li I really like the primate in this. Knuckle Punch. And the next turn we'll be able to evolve and we'll be able to... I wish, I wish here that I had red card. And I guess red card and get all those cards out of his hand. But that's not what we got. That's fine. That's fine. What's your retreat cost? Are you gonna retreat that Bulbasaur? That... EX execute is not fine. <laughs> that is not fine. Not fine at all. Okay, that's okay. Because we're gonna get the KO here. What did he just do? Oh, he retreated? Okay, that's. That is what it is. That's unfortunate. But I can force him out of this execute. Um, what is this? Two? Yeah. So. Because if he hits me once. Okay, I, I hit damage one time. I think that's what we do. We hit him once. Um, next turn he'll be able to hit us for...
80 max. Um, but we can force him out and maybe get him to put the bubble sorter. Because he's going to get stuck with whatever he puts out. <laughs> Although he might have an Erica card to play. Come on, give me Tails, give me Tails, give me Tails, give me Tails. Luck be on my side. Boom, baby. We'll take it. We are going to Potion. Um, we're going to do him on Chan, because he can do 30. We are going to Potion Armachoke, just because... Got to. I'm a little nervous that if I don't, <laughs> what he might do. What does our cheat cost on that Lilligant? Yeah. I mean, that was, that was the that was the best move to make right there. Because he's gonna have to use his energy retreat, <sighs> and then hop back in. If I could get Machamp right now, that'd be it. That would be it. Unless he has Erica. He's gonna swap back out, obviously. I mean, he could take me out, though. I need Machamp, or I need... Primate. That's what I need right now. What you doing, buddy? What you gonna do? Yeah, I know. Yeah, we all knew. Come on, get a tails. 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 Oh, dude, come on. If I get my champ, I'm gonna be so upset. If I get my champ, it's actually probably over. I need. I need primate. I mean, I just say we do hit my Chan, right? I can at least hit him no matter what I get. That's not helpful. <laughs> I can now. <laughs> like I'm gonna look at my deck and see that I'm not gonna get anything. I I don't think there's anything I can do. I mean, it's gonna take me four turns to do anything. Yeah, we'll have to concede here. I just don't have enough cards for this deck to work, unfortunately. I'd like to get one win with it. We just have, like, have to get... We have to get the cards. <laughs> like, that's it. Uh, thanks. Thanks, Power Creep. <laughs> I think maybe we just do something with some stall potential. How does Dizzy Punch work? Uh, this deck does 30 damage for each heads. I'm going first, which I don't I don't love. I'd love to go second. Um, Machop. We already have Primate, so that's good. So, we have two Power Balls, which means we'll be able to look for basics. So, means we sh I feel like we'll probably get Mankey, which will be good. Okay. Oh, he's also using a Fighting deck. Let's go. Okay, we just need to get Mach uh, Machoke. So, Pokeball, Mankey, what I say? Pokeball, and Sandshrew. That's good. I'm not going to put Sandshrew down just yet. Um, how much does he need? He needs two. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna put Sandshrew down just yet. Are we able to get an energy on our Machop next turn? But it'll be three turns. All right, well now I'll probably put Sandshrew out. Um.
here's the thing. In two of his turns, he'll be able to hit me for 70. Which won't kill me. And then I'll be able to do 100. To him. So I think we... Hit him here? Because we have to, if we want to get him out. Unless we have to get X speed, which there's no guarantee. So we hit him here. He's at 90. Go get an energy, still won't be able to do anything. And I'll have a Mankey with one energy that I can swap in. And evolve, and then he'll hit me for 70 with Land Crush. That'll end his turn, I'll come back, and I'll be able to hit for 100 with Mankey. I think that's that's the move. Unless he retreats and doesn't hit me. But I think he will. He either doesn't hit me um, I need two. Oh no. Oh no. I should have put that on the top then. It doesn't, well, it wouldn't have mattered. It's just gonna have to be a sacrifice, <laughs> which is unfortunate because um, Machamp is our best card in this deck. And if we aren't gonna be able to use it, we're gonna be a little, a little in trouble. Which is why it would be helpful to have two Machops. Freaking Marowak, EX. Oh man. The EX cards are so deadly, bro. One point. Alright, Professor's Research. Um... Let's see what kind of cards you have. Hand scope. Um... Nothing to be afraid of. Uh, so let's go ahead and drop these guys. And if he goes down, I want to be able to stall a little bit with Kangaskhan. And so let's do fight back. I would love a potion. Because once he hits me, <laughs> I'm going to need it. But if we could get 100 off on the Marowak and then finish it off with a, a, a good Dizzy Punch. Or even Sand, Sand Slash. Did I put an energy down? I think so. I had to have, right? If we can just get one hit off on that Marowak, we'll be good. Got an EX speed. Um... Question is, uh, we're gonna go down because we don't have our potion. Do we stall with Dizzy Punch for a little bit? Try to get our potions? I think we do. Let's retreat. I just need one. I just need one to land. That's it. Okay. Cool. Perfect. So it goes down. Ooh.
Let's see. Oh, we're weak. He could hit me. Oh my gosh. He's gonna take out my primate. Oh, I'm so upset. I did not even see that. Ah, oh, no. We were trying to save our primate and we just lost him. <laughs> That's brutal. That hurts. That really hurts. That really, really hurts. This is a tough deck to try to use. Um... I mean, at this point... We could maybe get 60 on the Marowak before it does us in. And he's definitely going to... Yeah, so we just swap the, the Marowak in and just try to get the Licks in while we can. And hope we survive. <laughs> we have to get 60. It has to miss. Okay, we're not getting 60. Come on. Oh my god. I mean, even with 80, I mean... Alright, we're just gonna concede. <laughs> okay, he's gonna take me out. And then he's gonna... He's got me. That hit my jam, bro. What a good, like, to be able to hit my bench, Pokemon. Oh my gosh, we could have won that. I, that should have been mine. I did not look at where I was putting my energy. I was like, let me get Mankey ready for what? I didn't even have Primate. Going second. Okay. go Minky first and hope that we get Primate. Okay, what can you do? Let's hit so hard, actually. If I don't get Primate in the first two turns, that's it. <laughs> I may be adding Farfetch'd into some of these decks. I don't even know if I have Farfetch. Bro. We're golden. We're golden. We made the correct decision. We made the correct decision. Unfortunately... With something that hits as hard as Farfetch'd, we won't have Minky for very long. Just gonna pop him out. Low kick. How much health do we have? 90? So we'll, we'll be at 50, so we can survive. We'll be able to survive another attack. I, don't, I actually don't know if he'll be able to... Hmm. From that, I'm not so sure. Fire main? So... We're gonna do 100. This only needs one, but the most he can do is 40. 
I'll survive with Tim. It should be a pretty clean knockout, honestly. Which is nice compared to how these past games have been going. <laughs> I don't think he can win this. Like, there's nothing he can do. Oh. He can evolve. <laughs> he can evolve. Um, which was kind of a bad move for him. Um, what do we want to do? I mean, he's going down, and then Charmeleon's coming out, but Charmeleon won't be able to do anything because he doesn't have enough energy. So we should be good. We got really lucky with that Primate draw. <laughs> I mean, he's got to concede, or just die. Do we make him wait? <laughs> oh, got it. <laughs> That's funny. Chee! Bro, let me wipe you out, bro. Let me full sweep you. Thank you. <laughs> Poor guy. Well, that's good. That's a pretty decent hand, actually. We're gonna be when we start off with Primate, it's, it's gonna be a good match. Um, Pokeball, Sand Slash. Bro, this dude's cooked. This dude's cooked. My charger keeps not charging. Okay, so it's gonna take him two turns to do any damage to us, which is fine. Cause it's gonna take us two turns to get Prime Ape anyways. So we'll get 30 damage on us. And then we should be able to kind of clean up from there. And once we take 30, we can also heal. I think this is going to be kind of a sweep. If I don't, if I don't mess it up. <laughs> There's always the chance that I screw it up. Because <laughs> we could have won at least like another battle or two back there, but... Alright, buddy. Alright, buddy. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Dead trio. Nice. Okay, so we're gonna put my chop down. Gonna give energy to Mankey. Actually, he's not even gonna be able to attack us once before we evolve and clear him out. Which might. If we can bait him into hitting us once, your opponent can't use any supporter cards for their hand from their hand during next turn. I mean, do we even need to bait him into attacking us? Because we'll just do... <sighs> we could bait him into attacking us, but we're going to clear out this duck anyways. So we're not going to do that. Right back. So he's got two turns to evolve his Gyarados. But in two turns, his... In two turns, his Psyduck goes down no matter what. And then on the third turn, his Magikarp goes down if he doesn't evolve. So he has to evolve. You don't have time. How funny it would have been if he if the computer picked magic card for him. So he has to hit us. 
Well, he doesn't have to. He could stall two turns. I think that's his best bet is to stall because it keeps him alive for a little bit longer. Can't scope. Um, I mean, I might as well just to see like what homie's packing, right? Like, does he have Gyarados? Probably not. He does. Which is not good news for us. <laughs> I should have baited him into hitting me. And then we could have cleared out his... He's got no reason to attack. If he'll be able to take me out in one turn anyways. I should have baited him into hitting me. I don't know if he would have, though. He did, did he have an energy on his ducklet? I don't think he did. I think he's just kind of using them as walls, since he already has Gyarados. But he can't swap in and have Gyarados. If I get my red card, it could be over. That'd be really great. Or if I got Professor and then red card. Like, do you evolve here? You do. Oh, that's devious. Um, <sighs> I think we Sabrina. Get 40 off. Um... I don't think we can come back though. Well, we, we'll have two turns with Machamp. Um, uh, yeah, I think that's what we do. <laughs> and if I was doing 100 right now, that'd be it. Did I not use Sabrina? Yeah, he's thinking. I was like, what's happening here? I mean, if he switches in Gyarados, that's our only way to take Gyarados down, right? And that's... yeah, okay. He's probably thinking it doesn't matter. But it does. Because it's my only way to win. <laughs> As if he switches in. Because he can't take out Machamp. Right? But like, Machamp has to take him out. <laughs> I don't have any more cards. <laughs> I don't have any more basic Pokemon. Alright. Come on, dude. Hyper Beam. Got it. What'd be great right now is a professor's research. Let me draw two cards. Um. Thank god I have Machamp. If I didn't, it'd be over. Okay. So, energy on Machoke. Sandshrew. Evolve. Seismic Toss. <laughs> so, he hits me once for 100. I'm good. I re-up our energy. Hit him again, he's down. I'm at 50 health. And then he switches in one of his lower, lower Pokemon. And we should be able to take him out. And we should be able to. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> this is not like. No oh, man, Cloister. How much damage does Cloister do? Seventy. I think Cloister's gonna clutch it for him. Actually, <sighs> yeah, I think Cloister wins it.
Um, I could retreat. Okay, where do I want this to go? Oh, okay. We're gonna put on our Diglett. Oh, I can't evolve into Dugtrio though. Can we retreat into Diglett? Mud slap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, take care of his Gyarados. He moves in. I should I shouldn't have I should have gone into Sand Slash, sacrificed Sand Slash, so I had Doug Trio, who could maybe avoid damage. That's what I should have done and I misplayed here. Okay. So, I think my only real option is. How much does this do? 10? Yeah. I don't think I win there. Red card doesn't do anything for me. And we'll concede, because I don't have any more energy because I retreated. So, I goofed there. Ugh, another loss. Well, <laughs> that's the free-to-play life, right? <laughs> you get what you get, and you work with what you got. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.